What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here and the hype for this new update coming out next week just does not seem to end because not only are we going to be getting a new map location for Blackout, a new operation, any specialist plus so so much more but also it does appear we're going to be getting the very first DLC for Call of Duty Black Ops 4. Now on the Call of Duty mobile app, one of the many features it offers is a heat seeking view of where you either got kills or died on on a certain location for a map and on some of the players applications when they go on to the view list for all of the maps we have two map names that are not available in black ops 4 i'm gonna have these images from as many people that i could find over on the internet as much as possible and the names of these maps are called elevation and madagascar now we don't have any previews or images that kind of stuff to show you guys what the maps look like we simply just have the two names elevation sounds like it's going to be set up with a skyscraper theme or maybe up in the mountain region somewhere i don't know i think that's a pretty original idea um, it does fit the name of the map really really well but as for madagascar of course i think it's going to be set up in the island of madagascar maybe there it's going to be like a jungle theme but basically guys these could potentially be two new maps coming to black ops 4 and if so then we do have a little bit of insight on how the dlc season will be set up for this year because if you buy the black ops pass then you get a total of 12 multiplayer maps plus four zombies maps so I think for every month we will get maybe two or one multiplayer map and then a zombies map here and there to spread everything out. And so far we of course have the names of two maps plus a zombies map called Night of the Dead which got leaked out a few days ago as well. Plus the backstory for a bunch of the new zombie characters. And yeah, very, very different. But honestly though, I think I prefer this new system better. Because sure, we're not getting as many new maps for each of the four DLC drops. But we still are going to be getting new maps every single month for both multiplayer and zombies. Plus that gives the devs more time to, you know, focus on adding content in other areas. Such as adding new specialist characters every month. New map locations and events for Blackout new operation events etc so definitely think this is going to make a lot more of the fans happier in the long run but as for now nothing is 100% confirmed yet although I will say I'm confident that this is how the DLC is going to work based off of the recent leaks and rumors we got a few months ago before the game was released but please tell me down below in the comments your thoughts about this do you think this is how the DLC season is going to be set up and your thoughts on the map leaks now one last thing before I go is today is championship Sunday for the Call of Duty World League and that means one Call of Duty Esports team is going to take home a prize pool of 250 grand plus a championship so a ton of money is on the line and up for grabs and Esports this year is just so fun to watch I've kept up today with a lot of the series and my pick to win of course is Optic they're just looking so unstoppable this year TJ Halley is a young star man Optic made a really smart move picking up TJ and Dashi the team gets younger and yeah so the team I can see definitely taking home the championship is the green wall but as for who could take them down um maybe EU that's the only team I could see but even then though Optic has been shredding through all the teams in their pool they 3-0'd LG yesterday so I just really don't see anybody taking them down for this event but if you guys keep up today with competitive and esports then give me your pick in the comment section down below as well highly recommend tuning in and checking out the stream because competitive cod is very entertaining plus you get to see some of the best players go head to head with each other also again guys tell me your thoughts about the new dlc this season do you agree or disagree and drop a like if you guys enjoyed and thanks for watching till next time i'll see you guys later